Seven-day removal order has been served to occupiers of illegal structures around the Marwa waterfront area in Lekki, Lagos. Senior correspondent Ivy Kano reports that the notice served by the state task force could be followed by evictions in the event of non-compliance. Illegal structures, shanties, containerized shops and squatters are the targets of government's urban renewal policy. These operatives of the Lagos State Environmental and Special Offenses Enforcement Unit Tax Force are here to deliver some home fruit. They believed that the objective is one that can be achieved by moral suasion in spite of the looming um, deadline. You know this place is government's right here is supposed to be coastal route. Reserved in case there will be hold up in few that's uh, lucky. This is another road route that, that the government created so as you can go down to Aja. Fine. All of you have built. They want to utilize this place now. They want to start building here. They want to construct this road. So thereby I want to give you just seven days to take everything that belongs to you within seven days. Mm. After the expiration of that seven days, I'll be here. The state government is concerned about the danger of overlooking buildings erected without authorization. I asked, is there any approval? You said no. I said, is there any permit? You said no. So that means you are using the government land illegally. I am happy you said it is not IDP camp. We don't have any in Lagos. This is a right of way. This is a coastal route reserved for a future route, and that future has come. We have to take the road. The Marwa Shanti is populated by thousands of mostly migrant artisans from nearby and far-flung states. The government says its main aim is to ensure that spaces like this do not become hiding places for criminals. To remove within seven days, sign the governor. Thank you so much. Ivy Kano. TVC News, Lagos.